Prince Harry and Meghan Markle were disappointed to not have received invites to George and Amal Clooney's star-studded gala held in New York City, RadarOnline.com has learned. An insider close to the royal renegades claimed they were humiliated and saddened after being snubbed by the A-listers for the second annual Albies, a benefit hosted by the Clooney Foundation for Justice, according to a sensational report. The ceremony honors courageous defenders of justice who are at great risk for what they do, and brought out a number of power players who supported the cause in late September, including Rand Gerber and Cindy Crawford, Emily Blunt and John Krasinski, Matt Damon and Luciana Barroso, as well as Rachel Wise and Daniel Craig. Sources said the Duke and Duchess of Sussex felt the cold shoulder from their pals amid speculation they have been casted out of the Clooney inner circle, despite the famed couple having attended their royal nuptials. RadarOnline.com had exclusively learned in June that Harry and Meghan were struggling to land projects after their $20 million Spotify deal went south and the former collaborators announced their joint decision to part ways. It came on the heels of the couple's royal bashing Netflix series and his bombshell memoir, Spare. Of all the snubs they've had to deal with since their move to Hollywood, this is probably the most hurtful, to Harry and Meghan, spilled one insider to the National Enquirer. George and Amal went from being their wedding guests and trusted confidants to totally ghosting them. The Sussex's biography Finding Freedom noted how the Cloonies had hosted Harry and Meghan on at least twice at their home in Sonning, Oxfordshire. We live not too far from one another and we have dinners and stuff and we're friends with them for all the reasons that you're friends with anybody, George had previously shared about their bond with Daily Mail. They're just really nice, fun, kind people, they're a very loving couple, and they're going to be great parents. After getting snubbed with the gala, a source said, it's a huge kick in the teeth and a massive embarrassment they can't really explain or wrap their heads around. Visit the all-new Radar Sports for all the on- and off-field activities of the biggest names in the games. As for why the Royal Renegades didn't get an invite, it was claimed that George and Amal don't have time for Meghan and Harry's drama or fakery, explained the insider. The gala would have been a dream event for the two, but George and Amal knew only too well the circus that follows them would have ruined it for others.